every run such a breath of fresh air and so much fun to go out on but just when the weather's perfect and you're out there watching the sunset as the dogs pull you through the top of the trails there's just nothing that beats that. Skidoring is where you are attached to your dog, you're on skis and they're on a harness in front of you pulling you and it can be a very leisurely activity where you just walk and they pull you along or it can be really high speed activity. I can't even remember where I first heard about it. Um, probably I think I went dog sledding in Canmore one year and realized that you could do it with skis and so I was like, oh, this is cool. So I bought my first skidoring setup. And at the time I just had an old retriever. She was probably like seven or eight. And I'd hook her up to a sled and just make her pull the sled. And then I kind of gradually ordered more gear and then got these guys and started doing it with them. And you know, they're good, strong dogs and they have a lot of fun with it. So I <laughs> just got carried away. <laughs> I run into a lot of people on the trails. I get questions about all kinds of things from the dogs to the weird skis I'm using. I have people reach out to me all the time up here now just asking how to get started, where to get equipment, that kind of thing. I'm happy to share because I think it's so cool that it's kind of picking up. Anything you can do with your dog builds your relationship, but obviously you have to be able to command them in different ways. Yeah, so going yeah. and stopping and turning and oh or for my guys to be polite, I'll sit them or lay them down when people go by. And then in that moment, we'll kind of just have a little ear scratch and hang out with each other while people walk by. And it's so much fun to get out there and communicate with them and go back and forth and do something like an activity like that together. Definitely improves the bond. Hi, I'm Jana and I skidore with my dogs in the Birchwood Trails.